Hi everyone, my name is Sarah Torres. I, I am co-founder and president of the Tufts Latin American Committee, which is a really awesome a group that focuses on Latin American affairs. So basically what we do is that we have discussions, panels, events, even a field trip, a, like a fact-finding trip to Latin America because our main objective is to create a space in which students can engage in learning, in asking questions, in exploring things pertaining to Latin America because we believe that Latin America is a very crucial region to to understand, to know about, and this space is open for everyone. No matter your level of background knowledge about the region or, or anything, we don't expect any background knowledge at all. Um, that I think that makes LAC very special because we we are, welcome anyone who's interested and, and willing to learn about a new region or, or this region that has so much to offer. Um, my experience in the IGEL began with Merge. I, I was one of the researchers that went on the Morocco trip. I researched about coloniality and the impact of Spanish coloniality, like Spanish coloniality in Morocco towards a Morocco's migration policies. Um, in addition to that, I also I was also symposium director for the Yemen Symposium, incredible initiative and experience. Got to learn so much about the humanitarian crisis in Yemen and all of the structural issues that that came with with the with a crisis and that caused that caused it. Um, my graduation plans are <laughs> a big question mark as. They are for most graduating seniors. Um, my, what I'm doing right now, I'm currently um, working on an initiative called Col Sin COVID, which means Colombia without COVID. And our main objective is to streamline international aid um, in the form of food coupons to some of the most vulnerable co communities in the country. And We're very lucky to count with the alliance with a Give to Colombia and Fundación Grupo Argos, which are two very established uh, NGOs, very established foundations that are helping us. And, and my plan right now at the moment is to mobilize my resources, the peop my connections, etc., cetera, and, and trying to mitigate the, the challenges that are being faced by so many as a result of this crisis that is impacting everyone at different levels. Um, my long-term plans are more blurry, um, but definitely something, something related to international development, um, social impact, um, research. I'm very interested in doing research as well. A lot of this comes from my experiences with the IGL that that it has encouraged its students, that has always encouraged its students to really pursue questions and and answer them however they want. So doing research, going to discussions, reaching out to professors, to experts. I think the IGL is definitely a gem at Tufts and I think we can all agree on that. Uh, you support students in so many different ways apart from allowing us to travel abroad, making it accessible to us, you also encourage us to pursue our dreams and you believe in us, which is very important for our own formation as, as scholars, as individuals, as future um, people, humans doing hopefully great things with all of the knowledge we have uh, garnered through our times. Um, and I mean, it definitely saddens me that I won't be involved with the IGL next year because I'm graduating, but I definitely wish a lot of luck to everyone who will be with the IGL. The IGL is, I think the IGL is one of the best, if not the best space, a source of inspiration, source of knowledge I have found, source of support um, that I've found. 
uh, at tops and and ever it's it's incredible and i'm forever forever grateful to to the igl for everything they have done for me and for so many other students